Hello, dear students. I'm Pratima again. Today we'll solve another interesting higher level questions from NCRT exemplar problems, maximum minima word problems, class 12, application of derivative. So let us begin. As I told, read the question carefully. If the sum of surface area of a cube and a sphere is constant, it is given. What is the a dimensions or age of the cube of the question is what is the ratio of the age of the cube and the diameter of the sphere when the sum of their volume is minimum. So question is about a cube as well as a sphere their surface area is combiningly given S1, S2 and volume is V1 plus V2, it is minimum. And what is asked, what is asked, what is the volume, what is the side and diameter ratio in this case, A is to 2R. So I hope you have understood. If it is not understood once, you can read the question twice, thrice. If the sum of surface area of these two is given, what is the surface area of cube? It is your 6s square if side is A and it is your 4 pi r square. They are combiningly constant. And volume or combining volume is minimum. You know volume is your a cube and here volume is 4 by 3 pi r cube. So you have to recall all the formulas then only you can solve the problem. So we have to draw the diagram. This is a cube, let the side be A and here the radius is equal to your R. So what I'll write, let the edge of QB A and radius of sphere BR. Then surface area of your cube is equal to 6 a square and surface area of your sphere is 4 pi r square and S is equal to 6 a square plus 4 pi r square. This is your constant. Next is volume. Volume 1 is your a cube and volume 2 is your 4 by 3 pi r cube. Total volume is equal to a cube plus 4 by 3 pi r cube. This is your minimum. So minimum means its derivative is 0. So either you have to convert into A to R or R to A. So with help of this relation we'll convert. So what I'll write, I'll write 4 pi R square plus 6 A square is equal to S or 4 pi R square is equal to S minus 6 A square or R square is equal to S minus 6 A square by 4 pi. Then what will be R? R will be under root S minus 6 A square by 4 pi. So I can write under root S minus 6 A square. 4 square root is 2. So I can took outside and this is your pi. Next I will put in the volume. In place of R cube, we will write this one. So B is equal to a cube plus 4 by 3 pi then your R cube, cube of this. So this will be under root S minus 6A square by 
if we'll take two outside, it will be under root pi, as we have discussed, then it's cube. How to write simplified form? It will be a cube plus four pi by three. It will be how much here? S minus six a square to the power three by two. And here, two cube is eight, and your pi and root pi, because root pi to the power three is pi root pi. So I'll cancel one pi. I'll cancel four, four, two times. So this is the final expression. So B is equal to a cube in term of A. A cube plus one by six root pi. These are constant I'm taking outside when the function is S minus six A square to the power three by two. We have to differentiate this with respect to A, dV to dA. How much will be this? This will be three a square. One by six root pi is constant. And to the power three by two, I'll put the formula. It will be s minus six a square to the power half into s has derivative zero. This will be minus twelve a. This is equal to zero because volume was maximum. B was maximum. Next, I'll simplify. So before this, this is one term. Let us simplify. It will be six, two, two, two cancel. So I'll write three a square is equal to three a into s minus six a square to the power half means I'll write square root. And here it will be root pi. So three, three again cancel. Again, I'll cancel one A. So this gives you A with this one. So I'm getting A is equal to square root S minus six A square by root pi. Next time, squaring this. So a square is equal to s minus 6a square upon pi. This is my a square. Next I'm directly going to your r square term. Because I have to find the ratio of a to your twice r. So now putting in R square in place of S, in place of A square, I'll put six minus A square, I'll put A square, pi A square, okay? S minus six S minus A square will be how much? It will be pi into A square. So this will be pi into A square pi into a square by 4 into pi. I hope you have seen clearly. Instead of this s minus, s minus, I'm writing another line, s minus 6 a square is equal to pi into a square. I'll put in the numerator. So it will be pi a square by 4 pi, pi pi cancel. So I'm getting r square is equal to a square by 4 or a square is equal to four r square. Now I'm taking the square root. So a is equal to twice r. So what does it mean? a is to two r is equal to one is to one. The ratio, this is the answer asked in the question. Now I'm coming to verification. Verification for verification, dv to dA is equal to 
dv to da is equal to 3a square minus how much it was minus 3a into a is minus 6 a square into half if we take the second derivative is equal to 6a minus you will apply the product rule 3a into half 1 by s minus 6a square to the power half minus 6 then your minus s minus 6 a square to the power half into 3. So if we we'll put a is equal to this will be just don't write all these terms to write down it will be positive term or it will be greater than 0 so minimum is verified. Because you are getting from this a is equal to s minus 6 a square root over so this it will be positive because this question will be asked for, from this year five marks question so it may be carries only half marks for the verification so i hope you have learned something you will keep on watching to learn more Thank you. Thank you for watching.